Hello! Welcome to Disneyland. We're in Disneyland and I just wanted to hop on and do a live because I've realized that when you go to Disneyland and when you bring kiddos, it's not necessarily a super relaxing vacation. Um, it's a, a vacation and we're having a total blast, um, but it's definitely a different kind of vacation. So I wanted to kind of go over what stuff I do and what stuff I use for something like a marathon vacation. Um, and what I mean by marathon vacation is um, starting at 5.30 and 6 in the morning with kiddos. So I have an almost eight year old and a 10 year old. And we've been getting up at the booty crack of dawn every morning and then going for 10 and 12 hours every day. And again, having a total, total blast. We're totally loving our, ourselves. We're having a great time. Um, but by the end of the day, we're literally falling into bed. So um, it's definitely been a challenge kind of as the the leader of the pack to kind of keep my energy up and keep myself going and keep up with the energy of the short people. So I just wanted to share kind of what I'm using and I pulled out a whole bunch of the stuff that I'm using and realized that I pretty much emptied my bag. Um, so I'm going to try and go through it quickly. Hi everybody who's on. Hi Aunt Mary. Hi Nick. Um, and um, I would love to hear your comments about kind of how you deal with um, marathon or endurance vacations or vacations where it's just go 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 and you're not really relaxing so first off my bread and butter of this entire vacation has been my vitamins I love doTERRA's vitamins they're awesome um, I'm that kid who takes my vitamins with me everywhere and as we take a meal I just take them with me I pull them out of a little plastic baggie and I take them um, a couple other supplements that I have to bring with me are Hynek, are um, my Mido2 Max, so this is my energy blend, and there's no way I could get through this vacation without my energy blend. It rocks the Casbah, so that's definitely a must when I'm taking my supplements as well. And then I also have, reach into my little bag of tricks, I also have my deep blue, um, uh, polyphenol complex so this is basically um, like anti-inflammatories in a in a capsule um, and when you're walking for literally we were at the park at Disneyland and California California Adventure for a full 11 hours yesterday um, when you're walking that long you're gonna get sore and when you're doing it multiple days in a row you're gonna get really sore so that's definitely a go-to for me as well that one also comes in a roller ball. Let's see if I have it. Um, this awesome little roller ball. We basically get home and roll all of our aching feet and knees and hips. At least I do. I know the kiddos are a lot more resilient than I am at this point in terms of soreness and muscle aches and pains. But that first day, our feet were definitely sore and talking to us. Um, I nap on the train. <laughs> um, we haven't taken the train at all, Nick, while we're here. We've been walking everywhere. We call it hoofing it. Um, we literally speed walk in this morning. We were running around the park. Um, a couple other things that I can't live without when I'm on an endurance vacation with the kiddos, and it's just me, are things um, that I have to be prepared for when I'm in the park. So stuff like lavender. Um, lavender is a an amazing antihistamine um, and it's great with inflammation um, it's also great if for some reason you get a bee sting or you fall down and scrape your knee or today we were on Tom Sawyer's Island and one kiddo literally fell down and ran her head into a rock <laughs> so I busted out the lavender Oh, it was a treasure chest, not a rock. So I busted out the lavender and I um, put it on her head real quick. And then um, we also put some frankincense on there because frankincense is liquid gold. So those are two that I have to bring with me in my backpack because I have two very accident prone kiddos who scratch themselves, fall down, um, run into each other all over the place. Um, a couple others that I have to have with me, let's see. Um, I said frankincense, lavender, we went on the loop the loop ride yesterday so that one um at the uh the disney california adventure park they have one that goes upside down and crazy and it was the girl's first time doing it and so we ended up riding it five times so after the fifth time i was really glad to have my digestion um 
it was really helpful because my stomach was not feeling it. I'm usually a pretty good roller coaster person, but I definitely was not feeling it yesterday. Um, a couple other things. What else? Cedar wood. We have to have cedar wood because throughout the day, our spirits are really high. We're really excited. We're run, run, running. We're go, go, going. And then as soon as we get back to the hotel room, it's such a comfy, wonderful hotel room, but tensions are high. Emotions are high. Um, I'm really trying really hard not to make this a mom versus kids trip. So we're trying to work really hard and these are really supporting me. But Cedarwood is my definite go-to to calm down and kind of do it gracefully. So Cedarwood on the collarbone, on the bottom of the feet, at the end of the day, after we're all just feeling completely worn down to kind of gently put us into that sleep and comfort mode. Hi Chaz, hi Jay. Um, what else do I have on guard when we're in the park there are so many germs in the park and then uh, when we go to sit down for a lunch we want to have something that's gonna kill germies kill viruses kill bugs so uh, we bring our on guard which is our immunity blend and a couple drops in the hand just rubbed over the hands and then breathe in through the nose can kill the germs um, can kind of coat the inner lining of your nose and kill any germies that start coming in um, and then it can also clear germs and stuff from our hands um, it's also really good I'm noticing that by day three I'm kind of feeling run down personally and um, the on guard is really great to make sure that my immune system stays up so we can stay spirits high and get ready to just go 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 um, I think that's kind of everything that I had that I wanted to mention that's really keeping us going. Um, a couple other ones are Elevation um, and Cheer, which are ones that kind of keep your, hey Jackie, ones that kind of keep your um, mood high. Um, again, I, didn't, I really didn't want this to be a me versus kiddo situation and it's not because we've really been kind of keeping our vibrations high, keeping our moods high with um, these awesome emotional oil blends as well. So um, we basically started this trip um, kind of with gratitude in mind. We've been saying thank you, thank you, thank you all day, every day. Oh, hi, Sherry. Um, and uh, we are kind of keeping the momentum but we definitely hit a wall today on day three so um we're relaxing this afternoon we are using our elevation and our cheer and we're gonna get back out there this afternoon and tonight to see the color show at california adventure park um but i could not do it without my supplements my vitamins my um, everything that I mentioned earlier, my digestion to keep my tummy going, to keep all the, the park snacks kind of in line with what I'm trying to do, um, and with the roller coasters. I think we've done Splash Mountain maybe, I don't know what girls, seven times at this point. <laughs> so I, we're just so thankful we're here. We're having such a great time and I'm so glad that I have my oils with me. Thank you for everybody who hopped on. Hi to everybody and I can't wait to share more pictures with you and let you know how everything went. Have a great rest of your week. Bye. Yes, yes.